The Biden administration is accused of obstructing multiple investigations into his family's alleged schemes, including trying to shut down an IRS investigation into Hunter Biden's son, or uh, sorry, Joe Biden's son, Hunter Biden, and FBI Director Christopher Wray refusing to hand over evidence on Joe Biden's alleged direct involvement in a criminal cash for policy scheme. Much of this was the focus of the film My Son Hunter, which was released in September of 2022. The film was directed by legendary actor Robert Davi, who joins me now with a big announcement. Mr. Davi, it is great to have you as always, sir. Don't leave us in suspense. Tell us what the announcement is. Well, the announcement is you guys can go to Twitter and you can go to uh, MySonHunterMovie.com and you can get the film for free. We're releasing it to the public because the crucial aspect of what the country's facing and how mainstream media and even our politicians are hiding the story for whatever reason. Now, we tried to have a screening, Chris, in Washington, D.C. We went to the Republican Party and the, uh, the Capitol, uh, I don't know what you call them, but the Hospitality Center, which plays all kinds of left-wing movies, refused to give us a screening in, in D.C. And uh, we wanted to do that and then muster up the uh, attention that people should see this film. Because what's been talked about on the news is dramatized here, much like The Wolf of Wall Street or American Hustle. So it's a very entertaining film. It's a very eye-opening film. And uh, people will be uh, able to uh, see through culture uh, what's happening in our country you know, or what's happened with the uh, well, alleged uh, and now investigated corruption within the Biden See, I got this film right after it was released. We actually had you on the show, and right after we had you on the yes. show, I think it was right before the film released, then I went out and got it, watched it. It was, as I told you on the phone, it, it, it took me about 10 minutes to get where you were going as a director creatively, and then once I, once I was on board, it was a very fun ride. I just got to get I, I got to get your reaction because I thought what you said was 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 intriguing. It's because the press and because of individuals in the Democrat Party are not talking about all of this malfeasance. The FBI now running cover for the Democrat Party and for the man sitting in the Oval Office and his family. A after you sat back and you watched all of this, th you're saying that was the that was the drive to get this film out in, in front of as many people as you possibly can. What in preparation for 2024? Well, be beyond that, in preparation of saving our nation from a political class that had, and a, a media uh, fourth estate that is in, in cahoots with the, uh, I believe, uh, a, uh, a propaganda uh, machine that's uh, keeping the truth from the American people. They'll only hit one note on the piano and there's 88 keys. And uh, they refuse to acknowledge this. Now, when we filmed, Chris, back a year ago, in uh, over a year ago in September, uh, from last September when we released it a year ago, not even the New York Times, they didn't. They said there was no laptop, except for some people in the New York Post and uh, the laptop <laughs> from hell and some other people writing things about it. So we made this film when no one was admitting that there was a Hunter Biden laptop. And now uh, we talked about the corruption with the Ukraine, the corruption, the deals that he made with the Communist Chinese Party and uh, many other things that are now coming to fruition through the investigation that Congress is, is doing to some level. And it was the frustration of Rob. us not just hitting people over the head with news and with uh, the same talking points from those stories, but to dramatize it because culture affects you much more. And that's why we wanted to release it to sure the general does. population for free. It sure does. You know, I wish I could claim credit for this, but it was Rob Finnerty on our morning show here on, on Newsmax who said, you know, we got to come up with new conspiracy theories because all the old ones keep coming true. <laughs> and, <laughs> and it turns out that your film ended up being a lot of truth and the folks need to see it. Robert Davi, the My Son Hunter film, now for free. Thank you very much, sir, for the announcement here on the Salcedo Show. We appreciate it.